Hi everyone! I know you're probably thinking, where is she? I'm in my kitchen today. <laughs> it's like I've got a kitchen in the kitchen. <laughs> there's a kitchen there and there's a kitchen behind me. Anyway, hi and welcome to a new unboxing. I'm doing this in my kitchen because this box is so massive that I don't think I'll be able to fit this on my dressing table upstairs. There we go. Can you see how big it is? I can flip it around because I've peeled the label off a bit well enough to get my address off anyway. Um, so this arrived today by DHL. Um, so I wasn't sure what it was at first because obviously as we, as we all know I do that many unboxings. <laughs> so I was a bit like, ooh, this one coming by Korea. Um, I knew I had a few outstanding this one so I was thinking, oh, what could it be, what could it be? Um, and it is G&T Club. And I have to say, I'm really, really impressed with this box. And I'm not just saying that because obviously they've sent me a box. I opened it up. First impressions count with everything for me because I do see that many that obviously when I get one that impresses me, I'm like, ooh. So I'm gonna just take this out as it comes out of the box. So you can see here. But look at how it's packaged. This is what impressed me so much. I was like, oh my word, that is so clever. So it's like a big massive pocket and it's a bubble wrap and it's tough, like really tough. And it's got like a little air valve on it. And I was just like so impressed by it. I thought, I've never seen anything packaged like this before and it's clever. And you know, the things that it's got inside, it obviously needs protecting. Um, so let me just see if I can take the little air valve off. I don't want to break a nail because today I've just had them done. There we go. I've snipped the little air valve. Oh, it's going to take too long for it to come, for all the air to come out. Anyway, we'll just go with the old method, which is taking everything out one by one. <laughs> so I'm going to get them out and put them on my side and then I'll go through exactly what's in this box. Let me see if I can pull them out. I just think the packaging is so clever because you're not going to, the risk of breaking anything in this is just, I really like it. Right, let me just get this, the most essential part out and then I'll talk to you about them. I probably should have, should have done this before. Hang on. We'll get there in the end. If I break a nail on a live unboxing, you will see me cry. <laughs> This is always the thing about live unboxings, isn't it? Right, I'm gonna have to wait, I'm gonna have to get some scissors. Hold on one second. Uh, <laughs> the beauty of being in my kitchen is that I do have something that I can break that seal with. There we go, I can get it out now. There we go. That's how tightly and neatly packed it was. Couldn't even get the gin out. So, G&T Club, our monthly subscription service, for all you gin and tonic addicts. Now my partner saw this and straight away I said to him, Bob, do you wanna do a gin and tonic box? And he went, yeah, he loves gin. We've got lots of different flavors. And the moment I think the one we've got is like um, an orange uh, gin and palm violet's one of the favorites as well. So, but this comes with not only the gin, but it also comes with all the other bits that go with it and some nice little snacks. So, and we have a 40% off code as well. So, what it comes with each month, it stays on here. It says one full size bottle, two pairing tonics, a tin of bonus botanicals, I'll show you in a minute, and sweet and savory treats. Now, the box is £40, but we have 40% off. So, it's £40 a month. You can get it monthly, bi monthly. I think I have, I have got their website up, uh, up here. Let me have a look because I was just looking about them. I saw a monthly and bi monthly. I think. You can possibly have every three months as well. Yeah, so monthly, bi-monthly or quarterly. It's £40, it's exactly the same. The, free, the delivery is free. But look at the size of this. That is a full-size gin bottle. If anyone is a gin drinker, they'll know it's not cheap. It's one of those drinks that's been really up and coming the past few years. You can go to cocktail bars and they'll have a whole wall full of gin in every different flavour you can imagine. Um, and it is a really popular drink and my partner, obviously, the past, past few years has sort of followed that trend and, and now he's got a bit of a gin thing. <laughs> so this one's by the Bigger Gin Co and it's a, it's, it's actually got the batch number on it as well. Batch number 15, bottle number 60. And 
it's a 50 centilitre bottle and it says small batch gin, bigger mentality and it is 43%. But you can see, I absolutely love the branding on it as well. You go all the way around, it says bigger and it's got the, can you see on the top there, it's a little dog. Uh, we haven't tried this brand, so we have tried quite a few because we we go to various different supermarkets and pick up the unusual looking ones and think, oh, that'd be nice to try. Or, you know, going to certain stores where they sell different types of gin and we'll like pick up a bottle when we're away or something. But this one, I've sent him the pictures because he's at work and he was like, gin tonight then. So you get the big bottle of gin. You then get his favourite tonic as well, Liz. You get two of the Fever Tree Tonics. He actually likes, he likes this one, but he also likes... Um, Mommy, I want ice lolly. Oh, just in a minute, darling. <laughs> see, as we've got, in, we've got a visit. Do you want to come and say hello? No, just gonna get yourself a nice lolly. <laughs> it's half term here, by the way. So we've got the two Fever Tree Tonics, which are there. Uh, he likes the aromatic one, I think it is, and it's got like a pink label on the front. But these are obviously the plain ones if you want that. And then we have, oh, I'll do this one first. So we've got the... Open it, open it, open Say hello to everyone. No. Hello. Oh. You're off school, aren't you, at the moment? There we go. Mummy's doing an unboxing today. Oh, where am I going today? <sighs> Maybe later. There you go. School. No, not today. Oh, that's... <laughs> it's G&T Club Freya. Sorry about that. <laughs> We do have these things and daddy's at work so uh, oh actually i'll do this one second i'll go back to these which are obviously like a thing that you can add into your drink they'd get a different one each month so these are your bonus botanicals so this one is juniper berries so you can add them into this oh i know i hadn't seen this one either before chloe this is a new one that i emailed this month and rob was like yeah yeah love gin <laughs> So we then got, oh, hang on, we'll do these. So we've got some crisps. So other snacks are Walker's oven-based fusions. Never seen these ones before. These are Thai chili and lime. I quite like spicy things. Hi, Chloe, by the way, back. <laughs> so those and this I have seen, but not this flavour. Love Cocoa. I've had their bars before. In fact, I've had them in a couple of different boxes. And also they do their own um, subscription, which I think Nazia reviewed actually for them. Uh, and this is Love Cocoa and it is gin and tonic, 70% organic dark chocolate, which is absolutely perfect for this box, isn't it? So those are the snacks. And then this goes in line with the charity. Now we'll talk to you about the charity to put my MacBook next to me because I started looking into it and I thought I need to sort of go with what they're telling me on here. So this is lemonade. Now this comes with the box and this is their lime and it says organic limeade supports fair trade. And this is a 330 ml bottle. So it's a drink. I don't know if you want to. You suppose you could add the, the gin to it. I imagine you can just drink it on its own because it's a soft drink. Now, they're... They follow this charity and they donate 5% each month of their profits too. And it is the uh, G&T Club. It says Charity and Lemonade Foundation. And it says they have committed to giving 5% of all of the profits to Lemonade and Charity Foundation. And it talks a bit about it and it says they were founded in 2010 and they aim to contribute to the sustainable improvement of social, economic and ecological structures in the global south. Now, I really love companies that will give back to charity because at the end of the day, you know, we spend so much money on these things and to just give a tiny bit, it's, I just think it's amazing. And obviously you've got all the details here of what comes with the cards, but it does tell you about each gin as well. So if you want to have a look onto, onto the back, I just think it's an amazing thing. And the price of the box I think is really good considering I'm going to retail that. That's going to be at least... I'm going to guess here by what I buy from Rob and obviously, you know, what we pick up in supermarkets and things. I haven't yet looked up the prices. I will put it in my full review, but I'm going to guess that that alone is anywhere between £25 plus, maybe £20 to £30, I would say, just for that. So you're obviously getting that and then you're getting the two tonics and then you're getting, which is the extra from the uh, lemonade, which is from their uh, charity. And then you're getting your snacks. 
and you're also getting the little juniper berries as well and your delivery is free it's included and it comes by dhl packaged to the rafters so that's not going anywhere is it i couldn't even do that and stab it with a knife <laughs> and then obviously you've got all the information cards as well i just think you know what will you drink that in a month you would if you were, you could drink that in a month on your own if you were a couple you know you could get through one of those in a weekend <laughs> we're actually going to a do this weekend so i think what i will do is we're probably going to try this first but i think we'll actually take it because we're going to a party on saturday it'd be a good idea to take that with me and then probably take the cards as well and then maybe it's a talking point isn't it when there's other people in the room and say you know oh, we I, we received this box on thursday um what did you say probably 20 pound and that's from aldi yeah I totally agree with you there, Freya. We actually do pick up some from Aldi and they're anywhere between 18 and 25 quid, the ones we get from there. So if you're going by the fact that these are obviously a smaller company as well, so they'll be a little bit more, um, shall we say, select and more difficult to get hold of because they'll only be sold in certain shops. I'm going to guess at around that, maybe £25. So when you factor into the fact that you're obviously getting um, the delivery as well, plus the 40% off, um, you know, that's where it's out. Is it about £23? So the 40% off, even just to try it, is an absolute steal. So the code for that, by the way, I will put it down below, but it's GTB4, and that's capital. So G for golf, T for tango, or GT for G&T, <laughs> and then B and the number four, and that will give you 40% off your first box. Um, I haven't done the maths, but yeah, it's about 20 odd quid, isn't it? Because fifty percent would be it'd be twenty pounds, so it's just over twenty pound. Matt, that is an absolute steal. You could give this as a gift. Do you know what I mean? You could order one for yourself, and you could give it for somebody as a gift. And the fact that it ships by DHL as well, which means you know you're going to get it safely, and it's going to come well packaged as it has. Um, and that box is. I'm going to have to have a fight with that to get it to come apart because it's rock solid, and the bag that it comes in. I just I really like it. I showed Robert earlier, as I said, and. I was a bit like, yeah, I really like this one. I could see us getting this again. Um, so check them out. Um, obviously, the website is www.gntclub. So it's and as in A-N-D. Uh, gntclub.co.uk. So also they're on Instagram and that kind of thing if you look them up. Um, when I do my full review, which will be, I'm going to say by Sunday I'll have done it because I'll have had a chance to properly test it then. Um, and when I do my full review, I'll have all the things in there so you can have a look and I'll do, I'll put the prices on as well so you know uh, sort of how much everything is and what you're getting it for. But yeah, I, so far so good. I was impressed when I opened it. Anyway, and sorry about the small interruption then from the small person. <laughs> He does live here, I'm afraid. It's one of these things sometimes. But it just goes to show you, you know, these are the kind of things that we buy as a couple, as a mum. You know, I like to treat myself. And sometimes it's nice to have a bit of time off when those kids are in bed. So if you're a fan of gin, this one is definitely going to be right up your street. So that is it for me for this one. Um, I do have another unboxing straight away after this. So if you want to watch that, tune in in five minutes and uh, and I'll be back again. But thank you so much for watching and for bearing with me. It's a bit of a more tricky one. I had to make sure I've got everything there on my counter. <laughs> so, um, yeah, thanks, uh, thanks, ladies. And you can watch back on YouTube once I upload it to there and obviously watch my full review. Bye for now. See you soon.